Okay, the last thing we need to do is prepare a budgeted balance sheet. So we've got some information here from Hockey Den. It says their balances on September 30th were equipment 200,000, accumulated depreciation 36, common stock 150, and retained earnings 41.8. Let's take a look. Okay, so it's filled in for you here, but we're going to go through how each of the numbers were calculated. Um, the $20,000 ending cash budget comes directly from the cash budget. Remember, they wanted $20,000 to uh, as a minimum amount, and we calculated that. $84,000 would be their accounts receivable, which comes from the cash receipts budget. The $46,800 would be from the merchandise purchases budget, which was 810 units at $60. And if you're just tuning in and miss some of the other budgets, that's okay. Now the equipment, I just told you a second ago, was $200,000, but we purchased $25,000 worth of equipment in December, so that needed to be added. And the um, accumulated depreciation is the pre-existing balance plus $4,500 from the general and administrative budget. The accounts payable, $57,000, comes from the merchandise purchases budget. Then the $28,669 for income ta taxes came from the budgeted income, budgeted income statement. Then the cash budget gave us the ending bank loan payable amount. And finally, retained earnings, and we had to calculate that. Beginning retained earnings plus net income from our budgeted income statement minus dividends we expect to pay will give us ending retained earnings. And then we get a final balance here of balance sheet, which should balance.